everyone. It is I, Blood Raven, back with some more Symphonies of War. Uh, we finished our chapter one. I've gone and done some learning on how this is supposed to work. Um, going to just point out, if you guys do play this game, go read those tutorials because this is the only way it's going to teach you how to build squads, how to change your class, how to upgrade units, what they turn into, so on and so forth. There's a lot of information in those tutorials. Uh, so much so that I don't, I'm not going to put them on video, but I do highly recommend you check them out. If you play this game, it'll keep you from getting frustrated with how everything works. Just make sure you sit about an hour down to, you know, sit there and read, because it's a lot. So, what we did off screen, and I'm about to show you guys here. We go. Alright, so what I did, one second, weird editing issue, but there it is. Alright. I'm going to move myself out the way real fast. Do, 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 do. Stick myself there uh, for now. Uh, just to show you guys here, um, what we did was we changed up some squads. We added some new squads. Um, one of the things you can do here in the marketplace is recruit. And there are some special guys that show up down here that will have a star on them. And if they have a star, they can be made a squad leader. And then these guys here are just some basic guys, and they just keep refreshing the more you buy them. Just re-rolls them. Um, actually, there's one more thing I want to buy real quick, and that's going to be... I'm going to get... Buy some iron. This steel sword. Buy the similar ring. Buy the similar ring. Cool. Um... So, one of the key things that I had to learn was you have to go into squad operations to do anything with a squad that's already pre-established, such as add units, move them, uh, change their class, uh, use an item, which we're going to figure that out at some point. Artifacts. There it is. All right, so empty. We're going to put an emerald ring because I want to turn her into a sword fighter. So this is going to help her reach that goal by getting her skill. Her skill's got to get to 20. She also has to build up the CP bar. Once the CP bar hits max, which the most efficient way of doing so is combat. You stick them in combat, they rank up the CP bar. Um, <coughs> once their CP bar says max, you can go to change class and pretty much change your class wherever you want. I want sword fire. Uh, Alkalite's kind of cool too. Hospiter. It's going to be a little more difficult because I don't have a horth. And her magic's not good enough. Plus she also have the Julie Diamond stuff. Sword Fighter, simple, easy. Get your skill up to 20. Um, and fill up the CP bar. Which, I didn't even look. Nope, not full. And these guys, not full. See, not full. Um, however, we're going to get there and build up the iron because I'm going to need a lot of it. Um, I kind of changed Zelos' squad up to be kind of, uh, balanced. He's got him in all his glory. Uh, another soldier in the front line to help absorb some blows. Uh, two archers and a healer in the back. Julius, he's a full-on archer unit. Sybil can't really change because she's maxed. Uh, these are the two new squads I made. I got a Simon is leading a squad of soldiers and a healer. And Ethron is a crossbowman leader with his own archer group. So we made that. Um, I wanted to form another new squad. So I bought a whole bunch of people and none of them can actually lead. So now that we've got that particular introduction out of the way, we are going to deploy. Or actually, I want to save what I've done, just in case. Cool. And now we deploy. Yes. Chapter 2, For Whose Sake. Damn, are we already too late? Our base at Marenburg is under attack. Looks like we don't have time for the rest of the army to catch up. We gotta save the base. 
Got it. Let's meet up with the base defender and eliminate those rebels. Alright, I'm going to start off. Oh, I guess I have to put them where I want. Ah, okay. So this lets me uh, put in some more units. So Simon's going to go there. Archer class go here. Deploy limit six of six. Okay, good. Begin the. Actually, let's look at the mission info. All right, so I got to complete the chapter within ten turns. Seize the Dominari temp Denari Temple. Seize. March the Trade Town. All right, target objectives captured. Target squads neutralized. Uh, seize Centurion's Rest Compound. If I am defeated in battle or Barnabas is defeated before being recruited. I have no idea who that is. Who's Barnabas? That's Barnabas. Okay. Begin the mission. It is my turn. I shall start off. Time to end this. Moving. Move this guy here. And now we can attack these guys at range and not really have to worry about retaliation. Full on Archer Barrage. Whoa. De Damage. Alright. Then we can move this squad right here. And have them attack. Alright. So we wiped out one of them. The time to act is now. I'm gonna go ahead and have this one move over here. And attack this guy. Alright, I lost one dude. Didn't quite lose one this time. It was a pretty good, pretty good rough run right there. Alright, so this one. We're gonna move here. Attack this group. Let's see how well my infantry wall here works. Ow! Heal. Alright, this guy here is pretty brave. Even though the leader's dead. They'll notice this one for sure. Alright, go ahead and round them up. Spears in the chest. Alright, that one has been defeated. So help. Keep from getting flanked. And heal that soldier up. In turn. Alright. It's y'all's turn. Enemy phase. Bring it on. I ain't scared of y'all. Ooh. Heal. They're like right after her. Alright. That's two of your soldiers down. Oh no, they're attacking the crossbowmen. Whoa! <laughs> Bad move, man. Bad move. The <laughs> crossbowmen said, nah. Alright. Blood Raven, this battlefield has a lot of woods and forests. Woods being rough terrain slows down movement a bit, but offers some protection against long range arrow fire. Hmm, that's good enough. Uh, let's put the crossbowmen here. Let them attack these guys from the flank. Well, that guy's dead. Free action! Yeah. All right. Um. I'm just getting started. Move you here. We're gonna heal that one up. Ready. And I'm gonna let 
to attack this group again. See if we can't finish them off this time. Defeated. Level up. Class mastery up. Excellent. Send you over here. Cease. How can I help, my lord? Move you here. Attack them. The full arrow barrage. Wow. Such devastation. Yes. Get that class mastery. Love it. Alright, last and not least. Go ahead and finish wiping that guy out. Bloodraven? What's the world coming to with you saving my hide now? It's the least I can do, Banarbus. I owe you the world. Bah, everything you got, you got through your own sweat and grit. Wasn't my doing. It's an honor to fight by your side after all these years. Can't wait to show you what I've learned. Let's plan our approach to Centurion's Rest. If we go to the right, it looks like we're facing two squads of cavalry. Cavalry are fast and powerful warriors, but fall easily to spears. They're guarding a stables that we can take as a resource of war horses for ourselves. Bloodraven, look out for those walls. Those archers on top of the walls are protected from close range attacks, and their arrows will be much stronger. If we can break through and go up those ramps, we can take those guys out. Or I can try to shoot at them from the ground level, but I'd be at a disadvantage. Or we can go left for a more direct route. They've got one fort there guarded by a pretty tough squad. Taking that fort won't be easy. Blood Ray, but the left route is connected by roads. Road terrain allows units a high degree of movement range. Hmm, why not both? More objectives to capture, more reward. Okay. You got a plan? Alright, so we're gonna wait there and in turn. Whoa! Cavalry charge. Boom. Reaction heal. Leveling up. Awesome. Alright, you guys are kind of foolish for just charging down here attacking the spear wall. Whoa, that hurt a lot. how y'all want to play. Alright, I'm sending you here to wait. You were going to move here. Wait. Move there. Okay. Let's do this. We will always find a way. We're going to attack that squad. Bolly! Here comes Sybil, ready or not. For my people, for my homeland. All right, let's hear the spearmen up here real quick. They'll notice this one for sure. And we're gonna attack. So I can guarantee this one gone. I might be able to get this one gone. 
If anything, this will level out the playing field. Tasty. Boom. All right, we'll just wipe that one out. That'll work. Honestly, I could probably move this guy right here. Just go ahead and have him wipe out that last guy. There we go. Now oh, they're gone. And now we can move him back. And there's a gem's mine. Definitely want that. Alright, so now that we've kind of wiped out most of those guys, these guys can proceed to capture uh, points. And then I can have these guys just kind of break wall in. Heal. Alright, Rogue. It's our turn now. See that Denari Temple, Blood Raven? If our troops have fallen in battle, they can be revived there for a fee. The enemy can do the same, so it's best we take those temples no matter what. Alright. We're gonna attack these guys. Arrow Volley! Well, that wiped out the whole front line. Alright, let's wipe them out. Goodbye. Yeah. Get shrecked. Here goes nothing. Alright, let's attack the ambushers so they don't have a chance to ambush. Wow. Bing. Such devastation. Yeah. Alright, wipe all those guys out. You. You wait there. Alright, so. Stay strong, everyone. That's gonna be a bad idea. We're gonna stay over here. I'm just getting started. I must stay strong. Guess they don't have any injured. Go ahead and heal that guy up. Alright, so we captured that point. We need to get some capturing done here. And then take out this guy. It looks like he's going to be a pain. All right, enemy's turn. Go for it, guys. Here comes Sybil, ready or not. All right, Sybil sees that. Time to end this. She to go here. Sees that objective. The battle lies before me. All right, now, you You're guys. Bad. Actually, let's see. I can get him there. That's as far as I can get him. For Viridia. Let's go ahead and take this place. Delicious. Alright. And in turn. Wait, not all squads. Uh, oh, I know what you're talking about. This guy. I ain't got all day. Just in case something crazy happens and I get ambushed. I don't need my home base falling. The time to act is now. How 
can I help, my lord? Dang, almost wiped them out by themselves. They'll notice this one for sure. Alright, I'm gonna have her go and take that temple. Direct my blade. Mm, delicious gems. Let's see how well this works out. Gonna disagree with that outcome. We will always find a way. I'll let you go ahead and finish wiping out those guys. All right, out oh, there, dead. Let's attack these guys again. Arrow Barrage. Took out a healer. They took out one of my archers. That's done. But that was very important because Ready. I'm coming in the backside. Attack! Goes y'all's front line. Y'all are doomed. Doomed. Because here comes this guy. Roar. You should be fearful. <laughs> Just bounced off his armor. It's like that was cute, but it's wrong. Come here. Cease. Objective captured. Faction rank up. Here comes Civil. Ready or not. All right, and you. School is in session. Wait. Enter. All right, it is our turn again, and let's take a look. He's got two archers, two spearmen, and then whatever the heck he is. For my people. For my homeland. So he can fire at us at range. So this is not going to be an ideal situation. Stay strong, everyone. Your command. And then you will notice this one for sure. Let's get you back over here. In turn. Oh, uh, yeah. Because I don't want him going anywhere anyway. Alright, so they're most likely going to shoot at 
Oh, claws. So, Blood Raven, the next attack dog sent by the Capitol. Do you even know why you bleed for them? Perhaps not, until you've been made to bleed enough. Oh, he's got a bow too. Alright, so we're gonna move Time this guy here. Yep. Oh no, one of my archers died. <laughs> Medic! I'm just getting started. For Viridia! Move here. We're gonna do a heal on that guy, and now I can move him here, and he can attack this group. Oh, oh. that hurt! All right, now Zelos, get in there and kick some butt. Go ahead and heal my guy up. And in turn. Yes. Alright, this is it. What do you do? I figured you were going to fire at me with your one archer. How can I help, my lord? Go ahead and rain destruction down that one archer. He's still taking damage even though he's dead. The battle lies before me. Cease. Objective captured on turn 10. Booyah! They've reached Centurion's rest. Fall back to the keep and prepare our final defenses. Donar, save us. Chapter complete. Look at that. Flawless victory! Rank S. We only had one Surrenderers. Twenty years ago, Imperial Army Barracks. Sergeant Benarabas, we've got another one. Get your men organized and ready to deploy in two hours. Right. Another Denari temple? Do you have a problem with that, Sergeant? No, sir. The army is being put to good use, sir. Yes, I'm sure you think so. And tried to clean the uniforms up a bit before your men shut that place down. The war's over. The public has eyes on everything we do. With what resources, sir? We barely got enough coin to keep our boys from chopping my head off in a mutiny as it is. You're telling me we're supposed to worry about spit and polish now, too? Just find a way, Sergeant. Put down that paperwork and do it your damn self if you have to. We're all on tight budgets. Don't think my superiors haven't kicked me around lately, as you were. I can do it, sir. Whoa there, 
small fry. Who let you in here? Um, I'm sorry. I'll leave. Hey, don't sweat it, kid. Get on home now. Your folks are probably worried sick. Damn. Thought so. Was hoping you had a home to go to. Please, let me clean your uniform, sir. I ain't got nothing to pay you, kiddo. It ain't worth spending the energy. It's okay. Please, sir. There's supplies in the basement. Maybe the shields could have a bit more shine to them. Looks like I lost my appetite, too. Guess someone will have to take my lunch so it don't go bad. And ain't nothing special, but it fills you up. What a guy. Save the game. Absolutely. Yes. The Rebellion now makes its final stand at Centurion's Rest. Though Antares has lost most of his forces, his compound is heavily fortified and will not easily fall. Prime Minister Casimir, who has been a contender for the Imperial Throne, seeks the prestige of a victory over the Rebels. He has arrived outside Centurion's Rest with the Imperial Army as Bloodraven's force prepares for the final battle with Antares. Peace may soon return to the land. Alright, let's take a look at some of this here. Uh, conversations. Ooh, I got a bunch of them. All of them with Banarabas. Let's start off with this one. Banarabas, can you believe it? We've been out here doing what we prepared to do for years. Haven't seen battle since you were a street urchin, Bloodraven. Never thought I'd have to pick up the sword again, but it feels like a warm hug from mom, from mother. Can't put a price on that. How am I doing? Feels like I'm making it up as I go along. You never really know what you're made of until you're walking the tight rope between life and death on the regular. You haven't cracked under the pressure yet. By that measure, you're right where you need to be. Not too surprised. Remember yourself as a young street urchin? It's a bit foggy. That war turned two damned many kids to orphans. I think that's backwards. I think it's too many damned kids to orphans. But out of all of them, you showed up at our barracks shining as bright as a star. You just keep on going, even without a single coin to show for it. Puts a pauper above a noble in my eyes any day. I seem to have everyone fooled then. I have so much doubt about myself. I don't know why you or someone else much more experienced than I just take over. You try that and I'll get, and I'm going back into retirement. <laughs> All I want to do now is bust some bad guys. A lot easier than having real responsibility. You gotta fight through that doubt, kiddo. No reason for it. Believe me when I tell you, you got this handled. Thanks. Guess I'll have to learn to throw you into the front lines first, eh? If there's a good reason for it, kid. Alright, so we finish that one. Well fought out there, sir. Looks like I still have much to learn. Still calling me sir, huh? You know, that's no longer protocol, fancy boy. Technically, you're above me in rank. 
Dinar save us all. <laughs> How long have you been a Master Sergeant now? Just don't want to solely your name with an officer rank or what? Eh, uh, come on now. Can't one even imagine the likes of me sitting down at an academy, face buried in books? I'd sooner take a spear through the gut, kid. Nah, I'm an enlisted man till the day I die. Just don't forget me when you're commanding the whole army. I could never, Benarabus. They become friends. Next. Hey there, Sybil, was it? Blood Raven says you're good people, so you're all right with me. Good fighting out there. Thanks. Hey, right back at you, Mr. Barapanus. Pretty good for an old farmer type. That's Master Sergeant Barapanus to you, lady. Yeah, whatever. Hey, just let me know if you need to take a rest. I'm a healer, you know. What the? Sharp tongue on this one. Hey now, just giving you a hard time. Figured a military guy like yourself would be used to it. Never was the type to go straight into the jokes. Gotta feel someone out a bit first. You know, wine and dine me before you ask for a kiss. Heh. <laughs> Um, you? Sorry, Mr. Farmer. I'm keeping my options open right now. What the? That ain't what I meant. Haha, <laughs> too easy. Hey, I like you. Let's stick together out there, eh? Seems I'm not the only one with something to learn. <sighs> you're gonna be trouble, I can tell. Glad you're on our side. Yay, they become friends. Well met, Sergeant Barapanus. It's an honor to fight alongside such a legend. Oh, get out of here. I ain't legend at nothing. Nice to hear anyhow. Begging your pardon, but you have such a strange way of speaking. The grammar and sentence structure seems so free. Free, eh? <laughs> Kiddo, not everyone talks all fancy-like as they do in the academy. Where I come from, good old mellow mode. Everyone sounds like me. You ain't never heard someone from the countryside before. Fascinating. What is this mellow mode you speak quite fondly of? Oh, yeah. Ain't nothing like home sweet home. Melamo is a real nice town in the Rigoro Valley that sprang up from a farming market for all the wheat and grapes going in and out. I got a few bits of ranch land just outside of town. Been in the Fitch family for, for years. Best darn horses in the Midlands, I tell you. I treat them like my own flesh and blood. It sounds so peaceful. What's a happy life you seem to have, Sergeant Barabinus? How noble you must be to leave it behind to serve this country. Appreciate the kind words, but it ain't like that. When I put my horses in for the night, and looking at my land, always a thought in the back of my mind, someone's fitting to take it all away. Guys like me can't rest. Not in times like these. If old Barabinus kicks off early, I got plenty of cousins who would take real good care of the Fitch farm. But ain't none of them can handle a war horse like me, so I gotta do it, kiddo. Know what I'm saying? I understand, from a certain point of view. I cannot say I have much that makes me feel this way. There's my sister but she is fiercely independent and does not need my protection. I value life itself. I feel grateful to be given the gift of the senses that I may take in a Tanara's splendor. 
and the gift of friends most of all. Whatever floats your boat, kiddo. We all need something to keep the old heart ticking. Be safe out there, eh? Yeah, rank up. All right, so we did all that. Let's go to this marketplace real quick and see what we got. All right, ooh, Elizabeth is an alkalite. Uh, resources will be used as one iron. Hit and run mercenary. And Tristan. Hmm. That guy's awesome, but I don't have a leader for him. Or I might. Okay, so we've seen what the recruit is. What's the traitor guy? Seriu War Pike. That's nice. Alkalite's Mace. And a Sapphire Ring. Hi. Organize Army. Change class. Nope. Hold on. Go here and change class for her. Requires one horse and 20 magic. She's got it. She could also become a siren. Which I don't know what a siren does. Specialized magician unit. Launches dark elemental magic that has a chance to stun and or daze a target. Okay. Or I can upgrade to a priestess. Standard support unit. Able to provide healing in and out of battle with much greater ability than the medic. Or this one. Specialized support unit able to provide healing in a battle with the mobility of Calvary. Well, we're not in Calvary, so I think we're going to go Priestess. And promote. Boom. Priestess. Alright, so next you can go Paladin, Templar, or Valkyrie. Which we don't have any of that yet. Versatile Heavy Calvary. Brings healing ability at the hospital, but can now attack in battle and execute charge attacks. Ultimate support. Able to provide healing in and out of battle with the greatest possible proficiency. Specialized helpful infantry, dealing strike damage, and also looks extra damage to magicians. Alright, so we got that. Um, I don't think anyone else maxed out yet. Hold on. Okay, so he maxed. And he maxed. Alright. Change class for this guy. Oh, goodness. Alright, so I think I want him to become a soldier. Promote. Ooh. Champion. And it's while hander. Attack hits wide arc striking units adjacent to the same row. Powerhouse. Executes a double attack against a single enemy. Oh. Oh. Gotta get that strength up. Alright, so he ranked up. And... Let's see. He cannot become a soldier. He can become a spearman, a cavalryman, and a crossbowman, or an apprentice. He does have the what magic aptitude? Oh, that just requires gems. Doesn't require any aptitude. I don't want to promote him to a cavalier. Really, not big fan of him being a spearman either. Frontline heavy infantry, pull arm strong against cavalry. Alright, we'll go ahead and promote him. Oh, there's the samurai. Neat. It says the pull arm skill of that with the bow attacks of an archer. And. There's the sentinel. 
and the Centurion. The ultimate pole armor attack or his attack strike the units behind the target. Whoa. He uses pole arm and has a special defense against firearm attacks. Alright. That's awesome. Okay, so that group's done. Let's see, someone in here had a promote icon. Both archers. Alright. So change class on the archers. So they become archers, crossbowmen, horsebowmen, skirmishers, scouts. Crossbowman, archer, can attack from two tiles away, has the potential to upgrade to a class with three tile range. He gets a bonus against heavy troops. I actually want crossbowman for this, for this unit. Alright, so he has the potential to become a ranger, can ambush, and can fire a precision bolt. And then the war bow can take them up to three tiles away. All right. You are also going to become a crossbowman. Promote. All right. This guy did not get enough. And she didn't get enough either. All right. So Julius has got some guys that have upgraded. So we're going to have more archers. I really would like to change them into horsebow archers. Because I have the horses. I just don't know if I can change him into a horsebowman. So I can bring him down to so demote and then promote him to this. Okay. Powerhouse Light Cavalry Archer can fire from two tiles away, ambush, and hit and run with much greater ability than that of the horse bow. Awesome. These guys back here in the back just aren't ready yet. So give me some time to get some more horses. in here ready to promote. We're going to go with Archer for these guys. And this guy I think just died a little too early. Unfortunate. And I could change him to, yeah, let's change him to a longbowman as well. to an archer. Alright, so we're only missing one archer in that group. Let's see what we got in here. Aha! 
Hit and Run Mercenary, Magic Armor Guardian Mercenary, Assassin's Heart, Critical Damage is Increased, and it takes 25% less, okay. This one here, unit is solely motivated by a payday. Plus two capacity costs unless leader. Okay, so this guy has to be a leader, otherwise he costs more. And same with this one. Reducing coming spell damage by 50%. That'd be a good one to build up with too. This increases. Wow, that's weird for an archer to have. Uh, let's go ahead and recruit this one. And we're going to create a new squad. Form squad. See, 150 magic armor and guardian. All right. Add unit. All right, we're at max capacity already. Sweet. All right. So we've got a heal squad now. looks pretty good i'm kind of happy with where we're at at this point all right guys so i'm gonna leave it here uh we'll hit up the next chapter of this on the next episode so um till then guys stay swampy <laughs>